Hey guys, Sarah here. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing everything I got from my baby shower. So if you're interested in that, keep watching. And if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe before you leave so you don't miss any of my future videos. All right, let's get into it. I'm going to preface this video the exact same way I did when I have done like what I've gotten for Christmas videos or my birthday videos or anything like that. This video is not intended to brag whatsoever. I'm simply filming it because there's been a lot of interest in it and just questions about what I was registering for. So I will actually create an Amazon page that shares every single item I registered for so that you can find all of it in one place. Um, everything here will be linked below if you're looking for it. Um, I have gathered tons of recommendations from all of my friends. I am the last of, well, I have a couple of friends that don't have kids, but the majority of my friends have kids. A lot of them have multiple children. So I've kind of taken all of their recommendations and compiled them and chosen the items that were the most recommended to us. So all of these products came from recommendations. So I'm going to try to get through this as quickly as possible. I am like blown away and beyond grateful for our family and friends that have just showered our little baby with love and just completely supported us. It is completely overwhelming and just like incredible. So that's my preface. All right, we did request books instead of cards. So behind me, there's like a long line of books, which I will pan over those. I'm not gonna go through every single book because that would be insane. But most people wrote a little note to the baby in the book, which I just love that idea. I like getting a book with a note as opposed to a card, and then he can keep them forever and read them and see who they were from back when he was born. So that was a fun thing that we did. Um, and I've seen it at a couple of other showers that I've been to as well. When I was first putting everything in here, I was trying to organize it by category and then it kind of just all fell by the wayside. So I didn't bring all of the larger items in here. So at the end, I'll go through and show those items because they're still in the living room and there's just not room in here until I start putting stuff away. This is a baby book. It is so cute. Um, it's just the, it's like a first, a year of firsts and all of the pages are like there's a page for every month, there's a page for all of their first holidays, and like an ultrasound photo, and their first smile, when they crawl, when they walk, just a bunch of things. So I think this is gonna be such a fun little book to fill out for him. My cousin knitted him these little socks. <laughs> oh my gosh, are they not the most adorable little things you've ever seen? Like how cute are those? <laughs> oh, I cannot wait to see him wearing these, they're just, the cutest. We also got this swaddle from my aunt. She made it out of goose fabric because I call her mother goose. So it was a cute little like personalized gift. We have actually quite a few homemade gifts, which is also just so amazing. Um, yeah, we have very talented family and friends. This is the diaper bag that I registered for. It has gold hardware. It's this nice taupe color and it's vegan leather. And it just had a million compartments, amazing um, reviews. And one of my friends that has four kids recommended this to me. So I was like, she obviously knows what she's talking about. I'm gonna go for this one. So this is what I registered for. I think it's beautiful. I'm so excited to use it. And then I asked Adam if he would want something that was like a little more his style. And so we registered for this one for him, which is obviously much more manly and he will feel comfortable wearing this and feel like that's his style. Again, it's got a million pockets and storage compartments and all the things and you can wipe it off. It's completely like waterproof. So both of us have our own diaper bags. We got a couple of sets of sheets. This set has little clouds on them. So I really like those. They're pretty plain and not crazy colorful. And then this set has more like succulents and plants on them. Hopefully you can see that. And then we also got this set that has neutral like leaves and plants on them. I wanted to make sure that we had you know, a couple of sets of sheets so that we're not worried about trying to make sure that they're washed because inevitably we'll have to change them in the middle of the night at some point. Which speaking of that, we got this mattress cover. This one goes with the mattress that we registered for. And I actually want to get another one of these because that my sister was saying the same thing about the sheets. If he wets the bed and we need to change the sheets, then in the middle of the night, we're not gonna want to be 
like staying up all night waiting for the new mattress cover to be clean. So we want to get one more of these so that we can always have one that's clean. For swaddles, what I have heard is to get ones that either Velcro or zip, not just the traditional ones that you have to wrap them like a burrito. So we're going to try these ones out. These are the swaddle me swaddles. I think the colors are really cute. And then we got a couple of the halo sleep sacks. These were another recommendation from friends and I got one in the three to six months and one in the birth to three months. So these again are just supposed to be super easy. Zip them up, Velcro them in, call it a day. And then we got this neutral swaddle as well. I think this one might be yeah, this one is a more traditional swaddle that you actually wrap them up in. And this one is, um, yeah, it's a muslin swaddle. Another highly recommended product were these, I don't know if these are muslin or what they are. I think they are muslin little washcloths. Apparently these are good for everything. Um, so I don't know. I will report back. Um, I'm sure I'll do some sort of video with like my most used baby products, but highly recommended to get a package of these. So I will let you know. The Komotomo bottles are another thing that were highly recommended. So we'll test these ones out. I've got some bottle brushes. We got these silicone bibs. I think these are so cute. It was just a neutral package of them and they catch the food in there. Easy to wipe down, wash off. So I figured those would be very convenient. And then we also got a couple of spoons. Um, we didn't register for a ton of feeding stuff just because he's obviously not gonna be eating like food food for a while. So we figured we could get that stuff later. Um, this is a teething pop and you're supposed to be able to put anything in here, whether it's like mushed up fruit or breast milk or anything. And then they kind of suck on it and it helps with their teething. Another recommendation, this is a diaper rash, um, like brush that you can put on their diaper rat or their um, cream with this and then it suctions to the table. So you don't have to be messy with your hands. Boogie wipes, which I've heard wonders about. One of our friends made us this little basket and she put these pacifiers in them, which she has three kids. So I'm assuming that these are ones that her kids loved. She got us some diapers, which will be much needed, and some wipes. And then she got some essentials like the gripe water, gas relief drops, body wash and lotion, Destin and Aquaphor. And then she also asked Adam what my favorite snacks were, like my favorite candies. And she got some snacks for me to put into my hospital bag. So that was really sweet. She obviously knows what she's doing. And then she put all of it in this little um, tote, which is a, it'll be like a diaper changing station little carrier. So I registered for one of these so that I could put a bunch of diapers, wipes, cream, whatever we needed up in our room downstairs, just so that we don't have to be going all over the place trying to change him. We can kind of just keep these around the house instead. This is the wipe dispenser that we got. It was recommended because you can do it one handed. No, I'm messing it up. But yes, you can just do it one-handed. So it's supposed to be super easy if you have your hands full, obviously, which I'm assuming you do if you're changing diapers. This is a little thing to get his footprint so that we can put it into his baby book. And this is another look at that diaper caddy. We actually got two of them. So um, yeah, you can adjust where the little compartments go, which is really nice. Okay, I'm hoping that the lighting is better. It seemed like it was too bright trying to get used to this camera still. We'll try it out. We've got some reusable nursing pads that you can put into your bra if you leak. This is a car seat cover. I'm not gonna lie, this product always grossed me out, but everyone swears by it. It's the Nose Frida Nose Sucker where you suck the boogers out of the nose. There is a stopper, so it's not like you're gonna get it into your mouth, but yeah, these are little pacifier clips. I think these are so cute. And then butt paste. This is something that again, people just swear by this product. A little teething toy, a little rattle. And then this is natural bug spray, which will be really nice for summertime because we have insane mosquitoes. And obviously I don't wanna be putting chemicals onto his skin. I've heard that getting a portable sound machine is a game changer when you're trying to get them to nap on the go. We got this little stacking tower that I thought was really cute. I want to try to get him as many like non-battery toys 
as possible, especially when he's teeny tiny. And then these little bib pacifiers. And then as far as nursing goes, I got the Spectra. I think this is the S1. It's supposed to be the one that is portable. Yes, S1. So this is portable so you can actually move around while you're pumping, which I thought would be really, really convenient. And then I got some milk storage bags and this little container so that you can flatten the bags and store them conveniently in the freezer. And then this is the Haka. I have heard endless things about this and how good it is. You put it on the other breasts that you are not feeding from and it will catch any of the excess milk so that you can save it instead of it just leaking everywhere. This is the Baby Bjorn Care Carrier. This is the newborn carrier, I think. Yeah, and I've heard great things about this as well. Um, we do have a couple of like wrap carriers, but this one is one that actually kind of snaps. It seems a little bit more secure if you're like out and about. A little portable fan that will go on the stroller, and I've actually heard to bring this to the hospital in your hospital bag because when you're in labor, you get really, really hot. This is the cutest little puzzle ever. I love this. This is the Hatch Sound Machine that is also a nightlight. So it's kind of like a two-in-one product. I think that it looks really, really sleek. Again, it's something that everyone swears by. And I thought that this would be perfect to be in his nursery. And we've got a little mirror for the back of the seat so that I can see him when we are driving. This is the like fake grass stuff that you um, can put bottles and stuff in. It's like the drying rack. So I've seen this in like all of my friends' houses. It seems like everyone has this product. And then I'm hoping you can see this because if I move it, all of these books will knock over. But this is the Bumbo Seat, which is another product that I feel like all of my friends have and was highly, highly recommended. Okay, let's go to the living room so I can show you guys the like larger sized items. Here is an overview of the books that we got. He has got quite the collection now. And my mom got him this guy, which is from the Going to Bed book. So I thought that was really cute too. But yeah, he his book collection is definitely off to a good start. When I initially filmed the video, all of the big items were in their boxes. So I figured I would show them to you really quickly. This is the diaper genie, so we don't have stinky diapers all over the house. This is the baby Bjorn bouncer. I'm so excited about this. I have heard so many good things about it and how much babies love it, so I'm hoping that our little guy loves it too. This is the bathtub, and it has this little insert for him while he's tiny, and then once he grows a little bit, he'll go in the regular size. So this just can sit on your counter, I believe. So very excited about that. I do have our pack and play back here in the closet. We have a bunch of stuff back here. Um, but I will insert a photo of it because we haven't even really opened it up yet. So I will show you guys what it looks like. This is the changing table that we got. It has this little uh, mobile on top with a mirror so he can look at himself. And it's kind of like a silicone-y material. So you can just wipe it off. You don't have to worry about like doing laundry or anything with it. So I thought this would be just the easiest option for us. We also got the monitor that we registered for after I had filmed this video already, it was sent to us. So this is a split screen monitor. I've heard amazing things about it. And this is really recommended if you have two kids. And so I figured if we do wanna have another one at some point, it'd be nice to just get this one so we only had to have one. We didn't have to go out and buy another one after the fact. So. Very excited to test this out. And then of course, people want to get him clothes because baby clothes are the cutest. So we've got some socks and then a bunch of onesies and outfits. Okay, I'm sitting back down for one minute because I can't believe I almost forgot to show you guys th these things. I just panned over some of the clothes that we were given and these items were in that pile, but they're not clothing. So this was another like very highly recommended thing. It's the Baby Merlin's Magic Sleep Suit. So apparently it's magical. We will find out. It looks like a snowsuit, honestly, but apparently it's amazing. And then we got this little elephant towel, which I just think these are the cutest thing ever. So very excited to see him in this. And then his sister lives in Philly and she found this little Philly baby blanket, which has just a bunch of the Philly places on it. So I thought that was really cute too. It's super, super soft. And he will always know that it was from his auntie. So 
Love that. Alrighty guys, that is everything that I got for our baby shower. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Like I said, I will link everything down below in the bottom bar in case you're looking for it. And then I will also link every single item on my Amazon shop page that we did register for so that you can find it really easily over there. Uh, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and don't forget to subscribe before you leave so you don't miss any of my future videos. Thanks so much for watching. Bye guys.